The first time jurors got this high-profile case, it ended in a mistrial. Tonight, it's back in the courtroom. Terry Thompson on trial for a second time, accused in this deadly confrontation outside a Houston Denny's restaurant in 2017. Channel 2 senior reporter Phil Archer joining us live downtown where day one of this retrial was quite busy. Phil? Well, Bill, I'm sure you remember this case got national attention, sparked protest last year. Most of what happened that night was caught on camera. And again, this time, video is going to be a part, big part of the prosecution's case. In opening argument this morning, prosecutor Sarah Seeley told jurors that video from security cameras and cell phones, along with witness statements, would prove Terry Thompson was guilty. That John Hernandez died face down on the pavement of the Denny's parking lot with that defendant and his police officer wife on John Hernandez's back. Hernandez was asphyxiated as Thompson held him in a chokehold, and Thompson's wife, then a sheriff's deputy, helped hold him down. It happened during an altercation at a Denny's in Crosby. In the first trial, Thompson's attorney argued that he'd acted in self-defense after Hernandez hit him. That trial ended in a hung jury, with jurors failing to find Thompson guilty of murder or lesser and included charges. Today, prosecutors began the second trial by showing the jury video shot by Christina Sanchez, who witnessed the fight, and security video from the cameras at the Denny's where it took place. The judge sent the jurors home about an hour ago. They'll be back to begin to be, excuse me, listen to more testimony beginning more about nine. Thompson's wife, Shauna, was also charged in the case. Her trial was originally set to begin this month, but that had to be pushed back to give prosecutors time to retry her husband. Reporting live at the Harris County Courthouse, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.